breaking local tonight. Parents of a missing Montana woman are asking for the public's help in finding their daughter, Caitlin Barry. The 26 year old was reported missing to the Richland County Sheriff's Office Friday, December 31st. She was last seen in Sydney, Montana, December 21st. Reporter Maddie Beard Temple spoke exclusively with Caitlin's sister this afternoon about Caitlin and the ongoing search. Caitlin Barry's parents, Carmel and Hank, just want their daughter home. Please just. Help us try to find her. Hank last saw Caitlin days before Christmas when he dropped off food to her Sydney, Montana apartment December 21st. Soon after, she wasn't responding to texts, and after a few more days, he reported her missing to the Richland County Sheriff's Office. She's a fighter, she's smart, she's resourceful. Since then, local, state, and federal entities have spearheaded a search, including the FBI, Montana Division of Criminal Investigation, and Border Patrol. There aren't new updates from the sheriff's office as of Thursday afternoon, but Caitlin's older sister, Kristen Barber, told us a little more about her. She was such a unique person. She was very open-minded and carefree, very adventurous. Caitlin frequently visited Kristen in New York City over the past few years where Kristen works at a hospital. Kristen says they enjoyed exploring the city and trying new things, like this Bollywood dance class they took together. She also says Caitlin's open-minded and adventurous spirit led them to try all kinds of things, like boxing, yoga, and rollerblading. Once we were, I suggested we go to a vegan festival on Randall's Island and we got lost walking in the Bronx and we were walking there for two hours and like we're not athletic. We were both like this is not a fun experience and she didn't complain. Instead she's like oh there's graffiti, Let's, it's colorful, let's take some pictures and she just kind of went with it. Um, and that's how she was with everything. Kristen says Caitlin last visited in 2019. In the last couple of years, she spent more time at home. She's optimistic her family will get answers. I know how strong you are. I know you're going to get through this, and we're all going to be there for you on the other side. I just can't wait to see you again. Reporting in Bismarck for KX News, Maddie Beer Temple. If you want to learn more information about Caitlin, there's a Facebook page called Bring Caitlin Berry Home, where you can find t-shirts and car decals to buy to support the search. We have that Facebook page linked on kxnet.com. And if you have any information to help with the search, contact the Richland County Sheriff's Office at 406-433-2919.